I worked on the bay my whole life. I have eel pots, I have blowfish pots, I have conch pots, I have gill netted, I've done everything. But crabbing's the last old man thing left for me. <laughs> I fish in Forge River, so there's not many tarpon sites. But over the course of a season, I probably catch 15 or 20, and most of them I catch around the Smith Point Bridge. When you get in the coves and creeks, you catch them. Coleman's River, for example, is loaded with them. The only place I had turtle excluders was in Forge River next year. In any part that had a turtle excluder, I did not catch a turtle. Either. Guys don't want to do it. And it's a little bit of work to put them in, a worthwhile thing. I don't like to catch the turtles, and I don't want to kill the turtles. These funnels get all bent out of shape. With the turtle excluder in it, it doesn't happen. It stays that way for the rest of the life of the pond. I caught more crabs with turtle excluders than I did without. They do increase your catch. It might stop you from catching a conch or two, but that's not a big deal. You know? I don't catch enough conch crabbing to make difference. Who I am and what I'm about. I like grabbing. <laughs>